Welcome back to another video. In this video I'm gonna show you how to make a simple cinematic transition that I have recently started to use in my own videos. It's really easy to do and it maybe doesn't seem as much, but in my opinion if you use it in the right scenarios it can give your video that little extra pop and make your transitions more seamless. Alright, I'm now inside Premiere and I got these two clips here. We're gonna start off with making a new adjustment layer and put it on the clips. Then we're gonna split it in half. After that we're gonna search for effect called levels and apply that on our both adjustment layers. And then if we go inside the levels we're gonna find this white input level. We're gonna keyframe that and we're gonna put the first keyframe three to four frames from the last frame. Depends on what look you're going for but usually I do three to four frames. It looks good in my opinion. So. One, two, three, four. And then on the last frame we're gonna make it much brighter, so just lower the white input level till it looks okay, not too bright, but make it pretty bright. And then move it to the last frame. And then we're gonna repeat that on the other clip as well. So let's go one, two, three, four frames, make a keyframe, then make a one that's <coughs> and then make one that's much brighter. That looks okay. Then put it on the first keyframe of the second clip. Like that. Then let's see how it looks. Yeah, looks good. This is basically the effect, I'm just gonna add some sound effects and then we're done. For music and sound effects I always use Artlist, I think they have a really good library of music and sound effects and I have really enjoyed using it so far. So now we're gonna try to find a riser and a whoosh effect, I think those would work fine. So here we can find some risers. I don't really like these. Alright, so I have now found a fire whoosh effect that sounds good and then also a riser. I think these will work fine. Now I have added the sound effects. <clears throat> now I have added the sound effects, I'm gonna show you separately what they sound like. Here's the whoosh effect. And then here's the riser. And here's how it sounds when you combine the two. And that's it. As I said, it's a really easy and simple effect to do, but it gives you that little extra. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Leave a like and subscribe if you don't want to miss out on future content. Follow me on Instagram at Tobias Hilden. Also, let me know if there's something else you want me to do a tutorial on in the future. And see you in the next video. Bye.